Lucena Iloilo, prepared by Bunlowi S. Sigudini, 3 Florine. Municipality of New Lucena was formerly known as Simanban, a very small barrio organized sometime in 80s, which has a part of the municipality of Cabatuan in 1866. The boundary line separating the jurisdiction of Santa Barbara and Cabatuan was defined and Himanban was made part of the Santa Barbara. Intermarriage among the people increased the area population. Led by Bartolome Valenzuela, a prominent residence of the Barrio Himanban, the residents organized themselves and petitioned to the Governor General that they be granted independence by putting up a church convent and a casa real municipal building. With the help of the provincial official and Kabatuan municipal of municipalities of Santa Barbara, Kabatuan and Pototan, Lucena was separated from Santa Barbara on October 9, 1877. In accordance with the Direction General the Administration Civil, the first municipal official were elected and the first captain municipal was Bartolome Valenzuela known as Tan Abe the grandfather of the late senator Thomas Confessor and representative Patricio Confessor it was not recorded when Himanban was changed to Lucena but Lucena reportedly comes from the dialect Lu Ulu which means head and Sena which is the short version of for the flower as Susena, which means pure and peaceful, thus Lucena means pure and peaceful leader. Another belief was that Himanban was changed to Lucena after the name of provincial alcalde Mayor Pedro Gonzalez Lucena, the 36th executive of the province of Iloilo in 1760s to 1770s. When the American came, Pueblo de Lucena was again incorporated to the municipal, municipal of Santa Barbara in 1902 for economic security and facilitation of government. In 1921, the prominent citizen of Lucena petitioned for its separation from Santa Barbara in January 1, 1947. Lucena became a new town in the province of Ililu, thus is now called New Lucena. Martin Chofelo Delgado E. Bermejo was a Filipino military leader during the Philippine Revolution and the Philippine-American War and was the first civilian governor of Iloilo province during American occupation of the Philippines first appointed by the American and then winning election in his own right. Tan Martin, popularly, popularly known as Martin Chupelo Delgado, a native, native of Santa Barbara, was the leader of this revolutionary movement. Months after General Emilio Aguinaldo, leader of the Philippine Revolutionary Movement, declared war against Spain, General Martin Delgado, along with his volunteers, headed to Barrio Helicon, situated at the boundary of the town of Santa Barbara, Cabatuan, and Lucena, where they gathered in an open field with intense emotion, thundered, long live independence, Sunsa Philippine Free Press, 1953. Geography New Lucena is located in the central portion of the province of Iloilo. New Lucena has a total land area of 4,410 hectares, 10,900 acres or 0.83% of the total area of Iloilo province. It is 24 kilometers 15 miles from Iloilo city. The town proper of New Lucena could be transversed by land either way via Dawis Saraga or via Santa Barbara. New Lucena is crisscrossed by the roads from north to south and east to west thus providing roads for easy means of transportation. New Lucena officially 
The municipality of New Lucena, Hiligaynon, Banua, San New Lucena, Tagalog, Bayan. The New Lucena is a fourth class municipality in the province of Iloilo. Philippines, according to 2020 census, it has population of 24,314 people. Festival of New Lucena, Iloilo. New Lucena celebrate Himanban Festival. In meaningful observance, its annual agri fair this month and agro-industrial festival dub as Himanban will be held at the municipality of New Lucena on January 18 to 24 with the team Ipabugal nga ikaw taga New Lucena banwa nga hamili kag sa bugos nga nasyon na kilala. Cry of Helicon of New Lucena, Iloilo New Lucena, Iloilo has a historic spot that will let revive some of the province's most important historical scenes. Pay homage to the valiant heroes who fought for our freedom as the town commemorate the first cry of independence outside Luzon. Through the re- reenactment of history, cry of Lecon at 5pm at Municipal Auditorium on October 25. Historical reactments such as the cry of Helicon provide incredible window into how men and women live in historical times providing the community can sometimes the public a glimpse into the into what life was like during the conflict that shaped the town local history.